Damn, I hate this Android phone. I wish I had an apple. What? This is not an apple. This is an apple pie. Yep, that's the whole joke. Hello everyone and welcome back and in today's video I'm gonna try and recreate some apple pies from the one and only McDonald's. I feel this video is pretty suitable because there's actually one thing that my channel and McDonald's have in common and that is at the front of it is a clown. So to start we need to get our apple so I first grab whatever green apples I could find and can I just say look at the goddamn size difference of these apples. <laughs> what in the genetically modified shit is this? So for the next step, I then peeled all the apples and honestly, this was a great opportunity for me to slip in a prime joke about a peeler. But honestly, that would be some low hanging fruit. So once I peeled the apples, I noticed there were a lot of brown spots on the apples that were there for some unknown reason. But it was fine because I just cut everything off and chopped it all into small little chunks. Next, it was onto the stove. So in my pan, I placed some butter and once it was foaming, I placed the apples in and cooked them till they were soft and tender. Once my buttery apples were soft, I put in some white sugar, brown sugar, some nutmeg and cinnamon. And if it looks like I'm not measuring anything, well, you are absolutely correct. I just cooked the apples down till they became pretty mushy, kind of like an apple jam with a few big chunks left in. Next for our pastry, I got my homemade dough that was actually made in a factory and put into packaging. The pastry of choice was some short crust pastry which came in the form of a scroll. And while I have the time, I would like to thank the academy for all the support they have given me throughout. So to form the pies, you first want to roll out your dough which sometimes might reveal a hidden message about yourself. After that, I cut out little rectangles and laid on the apple filling. I then folded them over and tucked in all the filling and using the special equipment called the fork, I pressed down the pastry edges sealing everything in. I then cut off the excess to make it look very pretty and the only thing left was to fry up this bad boy in some oil. So once it was golden brown, while it was still hot, I then sprinkled on some sugar and it was time to serve. So with a plate, I got my pie and some wonderful vanilla soft serve. And the funny thing is, is that this ice cream isn't even supposed to be soft serve. RIP my freezer indeed. The overall result was a crispy pastry with a sweet apple filling that paired amazingly with the vanilla ice cream. Overall, I would give this probably a 7 creepy Ronald McDonald's out of 10. I was pretty happy with the results, but you know what could make it even better? Is if you subscribe to the channel. Yes, ladies and gentlemen, that will be all from me today. Thank you for watching another episode of the SK Food Show, and I will see you soon. Goodbye for now.